disappointed, obviously. Um, yeah, I I felt like I I didn't do much wrong today, but I didn't do much right either. It was just one of those days where I played a really controlled round of golf. I did what I I I felt like I needed to, just apart from capitalizing on the on the easier holes. Yeah, of course. I mean, I, I, I'm only human. At the end of the day, I'm not a robot. And yeah, of course, do you. Um, of course, you think about it and you envision it, and you want to envision it. I mean, I was literally my hotel room is directly opposite the big yellow board on 18 there, right of the first. And like every morning, I look out and I'm just trying to envision McElroy at the top, at the top name on that leaderboard, and how that would feel. And you know, at the start of today, it was at the top, but at the start of tomorrow, it won't be. So uh, yeah, it's up there. Um, I don't know. I, I go back to the couple of U.S. Opens in the last couple of years. I feel like I played really well and give myself good chances. Um, you know, I was tied for the lead with nine holes to go at, at Torrey Pines. Um, I got myself in with a great chance at the PGA and the U.S. Open this year. Augusta is going to end up being my best finish of the, the, the four, but I never really felt like I was in contention there. But you know, I'd I'd a I'd a putt to I I, I thought at the time to force a playoff at Carnoustie in 2018. Again, I've been close and keep knocking on the door. Uh, and again, I can't I can't get too down on myself because the game is there. It's just a matter of staying patient.